In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a domain email account with the Microsoft Surface. And the Microsoft Surface is the newest tablet to come up from Microsoft, and it's sort of a cross between a tablet and a notebook, because while it has tablet capabilities and it's really lightweight and it can also use a touch screen, um, you can also directly connect a really lightweight keyboard that also acts as the cover for the tablet right to it so there's no lag. So we think a lot of business owners will be using this Microsoft Surface, especially because it comes pre-installed with Microsoft Office Preview. So before we get started, make sure you've already created a domain email account. And if you don't know how to do that, you can check out this video right here. And let's get started. So to get started, just click on the mail icon right here. So you'll notice it says add your email account, but since we're adding a domain email account, we have to see more options, so we'll view all in, all in settings, and we'll click other account right here. So now you can input the information for your domain email account, and I'm adding my um, fictional cupcake company email. show more details to fill in more information. So the username is the same as your email address. So we'll just type that in. So, so to find your incoming email server, I've already opened up another tab. So right here, go to website.com and then access your webmail. I'm just gonna click on that and input the email address that we want to set up. So just wait for it to sign in. So right here, this is the information that you need. So you can copy and paste it or you can just write it down or remember it. So I'll just write it down. And let's go back to setting up our mail. I'll just put that in there. Mail one dot site mail server dot com. And the port is 993, and we'll make sure that the incoming server requires SSL so it's more secure. And the outgoing email server is the same thing. And the port is 465. So make sure that all these boxes are checked off. We want to make sure the outgoing server requires SSL for security reasons. And we want to make sure that the outgoing server requires authentication because website.com requires that. And now we'll just connect. So now we've set it up. So we're going to just email ourselves to test this out. So to compose a new email, click on this plus button right there. And I'm going to send it to myself. And it auto fills it in. Orders at antiscupcakes.com. And to add a subject, I just have to click on this right here so it's a touch screen. And I'll just call it test. And I'll add a message. This is a, oh, this is a test. And you'll notice that it automatically has uh, a signature sent from Windows Mail, and you can change that in the settings if you want. So to send it out, just click this button here, like a flying email. And it may take a little while to load and to send it out. So let's check out the sent items, make sure we sent that. So it's been sent, and now let's check the inbox. Got that there too. So it works. So that's it. It was super simple. And if you have any more questions or comments, feel free to contact us at website.com through live chat, through submitting a ticket, and through telephoning us. See you soon.